Hello, Taurus. It's my lady, and this is my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly express love reading for the week of November 21st through the 28th, 2022. Okay, y'all, so these supposed to be express, but they're lasting a little bit longer than I had intended, but we're going to keep it going, all right? But I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, commenting, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. So I'm already hearing something. I'm hearing they're gone. They're gone. They're gone. So I don't know what this is, but it's making my heart drop, okay? But we're going to keep going, okay? These are not the cards that would usually tell me about something like that. But if, we le if it leaves there, then... Oh, wow. I'm seeing a lot of stuff right now. So I don't even know if this is, is connected to this or something else. But I feel like a choking in my neck, like the left side of my neck, it feel like is being hit. And I see dark. And I heard crash. Okay, a crash or accident or something like that. I don't like that. And it's crazy because when I hear and see this stuff, it's in pieces. So I don't understand until I look back at the whole thing of what I just said. Okay. But, um, yeah, that's that's for somebody. I'm sorry, but... All right, let's see what's happening here with, with this Taurus. I'm hearing Capricorn as well, too, though. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Yeah, I had to get that out because now the feeling is leaving out my neck. It's leaving... All right, so we got card number 21 here. All right, so I do feel like somebody's on uh, a journey for something to go somewhere new, okay? I do feel like somebody may have gotten a message um, or somebody is moving very fast, okay? Somebody's moving very fast to get to that place, okay? But I do feel like it's not going to be an easy thing. All right, so we got the eight of swords basically okay um and this is the networking card so i do feel like somebody may be trapped by social media so it's like um somebody may be traveling to see somebody or something and i do feel like somebody's gonna get caught maybe somebody has to act a certain way because of social media okay somebody feels like they're trapped in the situation because of social media you know how these people act like they're so happy on the internet and then their life is not like that. So they're really trying their hardest and doing whatever they need to do to keep this person or to try to keep this image up, even though the relationship was gone a long time ago. Okay. That's the energy I'm feeling here. So this doesn't have to be you. It could be somebody you close to and care about. Yeah. And it's affecting you emotionally or mentally. Okay. I don't know if I cut. I heard don't, so we ain't going to cut. All right. All right, so now we have the six of, what is this? Hearts here. So I do feel like if this reading is for you, if it didn't just recently happen, it's getting ready to happen, unless it's an anniversary time, it's getting close to the time that this happened. Days, months, years before, okay? I'm going to just say years. Years, seasons before, okay? Um, But I do feel like somebody's been hoping praying for something to happen it's getting ready to happen okay somebody's hoping for some kind of emotional balance okay it's getting ready to happen balance in a relationship i want to receive what i'm giving yep getting ready to happen okay oh goodness all right so we got card number seven here so i do feel like of course there's always some snakes around so I do feel like, of course, somebody's around on some funny business. So just watch what you're doing, okay? And this makes me go back to the relationship. Um, somebody's looking for some kind of issue um, or some kind of lie or some kind of, you know, wrong again, okay? Some kind of lie, some kind of indirect situations going on with your relationship. So just watch out for that. Okay, so you got somebody, and I do feel like on the inside, I heard insider. There's an insider trying to get information to, you know, drag you. Trying to make it seem like, you know, or let you know or let everybody know that it's not as cute as you 
making it look, okay? I'm just saying you because it makes it easier, okay? Oh, goodness. So we got card number 14 here. And then we got the nine of wands. So I do feel like somebody is trying to fight to keep this image. But I, I honestly feel like the winning that's getting ready to happen here is coming from this snake, okay? Because this is where the winning is, the emotional balance is, the the hopes and dreams coming true is coming from the snake getting what they want. So the snake is getting ready to get some information, and I do feel like they're going to give it to somebody. All right? Definitely exposure. Everything is not as beautiful as, uh, as it looks. Oh, goodness. I don't know. No comment, okay? But <clears throat> it's just people that... It, it just hurt me. You know, people that, that live on making other people feel bad. And people that serve other people at the expense of their own feelings in life. It just hurt me. It just hurt me because it's like at the end of the day, don't know, nothing matters but you and yourself. You got to matter before your kids and your husband and your wife or whatever it matter. Because if you don't matter, then how can they matter? They can feel it. They can see when something ain't right. You know? But let's keep going. Get off my box. It just hurt my feelings. <clears throat> All right. Oh, goodness. So, we got card number 30 here. So, this makes me feel like the person, this snake who getting all this information, I feel like it's a parent. It's some kind of guardian or somebody that someone looks up to. Okay? It was like, oh, well, since they was doing so great, look at them on Thanksgiving or look at them on this day or look at them on that day. You know, they they putting it out there like, oh, this person is not all the good as they think. So it's like, that's crazy. So somebody got their family member or somebody that they trust or love getting ready to expose them for what's really going on. And then with the snake being there and the fox, it's not, I'm putting it out there so you can be free from, you know, feeling trapped to do what these people want you to do. It's like somebody's doing this to hurt someone. You didn't give me what I want, so I'm going to hurt you. Okay? All right. So, here we go again. Uh, it's like somebody is moving forward, fighting the whole way through. So, it's like somebody's fighting to keep this situation. And I do feel like, you know, they're getting ready to get um, tackled by somebody they love. Okay? Mm-hmm. Dang. All right, so we got card number four here. So this is the house card. So I do feel like somebody is trying to act like they're forming some kind of stability. Okay, I do feel like all these other offers is getting ready to come in after the explosion. Uh, but, of course, it looks like the person just want to try to set up their own life to make it more than what it is i do feel like there's a lot of begging going on like i know this person is no good for me but since everybody think this certain thing i need to make this happen i need to keep this together and the other person is just playing games to just keep it keep it rolling but the person is helping is helping out of well they is helping out his fight, but it's like they really trying to hurt somebody's feelings, but it's going to help free or at least let them know they can be free. You can be free now. Everybody know that it ain't as good as it looks, okay? All right, let's see what's going on. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. All right, so I got to look a little bit different for these. So these are, yeah, that's exactly what's going on. Uh, so competition, okay? So this card is somebody's trying to compete, trying to make it look like things are better than what they are. Um, I do feel like somebody's just trying to 
make it to that goal or we're going to hit 20 years, we're going to hit 10 years, we're going to hit two months, we're going to hit whatever the case may be. I do feel like uh, it's just, this is all a competition, okay? And then it's like the person on the side who getting ready to expose everything, they're like, the competition is over, okay? It's like this person is secretly jealous, but I do feel like they're going to put it out there like they're trying to help, but in reality... They just want to tear some stuff up too, okay? They ain't competition too. They want people to look at them other than looking at this person, these people, this couple. All right? All right, so I'm doing it again. I know I said I wasn't going to do it, but I'm going to pull one card. Ooh, all right, it jumped out itself, so we're going to read this one on top. All right, these are uh, Oracle of the Hidden World, Lucy Cavendish, okay? So this says, The Leap... I don't like saying that word, uh, bliss and belief, okay? But I do feel like after somebody gets this freedom, I do feel like they may end up just jumping and, and leaving the situation. And it's weird because I do feel like that sense of peace and happiness is going to come right away because they know they're free, okay? But this person, like I said, they didn't let them out. Oh, they told me to read the other one. They didn't let them out because of... uh good intentions there wasn't good intentions set behind it okay all right so magical tools writing and what did i say star crafting okay so i do feel like somebody's getting ready to create some new things um in the meanwhile while after leaving this situation so yes yeah, somebody is finding a way out but oh man i it's, it's just a lot going on here it's a little bit of the wrong way but the right way but i don't know other than that that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.